Hello guys, welcome once again to another exciting episode of Good Evening of Red 360. It's me, Sean Elizabeth, your host, and today we are dwelling on the topic spiritual wellness. You know, it's the, it's, we are still in the beginning stages of the year, right? And how you start your year is very important. And that's why we are bringing you these episodes on spiritual wellness so that we can actually nourish and feed your spiritual life. Once again, I'm sure... Once I mention spiritual wellness, you have an idea of who is coming. Yes, today we have on set Pastor Julius. Welcome, Pastor Julius. Oh, thank you. Thank you once again, Lady Morgan. <laughs> How are you doing? I'm great. I'm great. How's your week been? Very fruitful. I mean, productive. I love to work. That's <laughs> nice. Okay, so today we are discussing what is the best way to study the Bible. Mm, mm, okay. So I think I asked my pastor this question some years back. So I'm going to share from um, a knowledge bank and also from scriptures okay. as well. So the best way to study the Bible, okay? So when I asked my pastor, he was like, hey, we have two ways of studying the Bible. Okay. Okay, that is the topical Bible study, mm -hmm. okay, and the telescopic Bible study. So for a topical Bible study, maybe you take the subject of faith. Okay. okay. Then you search through the scriptures to find any scripture connected or related with faith. Okay. Love, any scripture connected with love, marriage, you know, those are um, topical Bible studies. Okay. The telescopic is when you take a book like Genesis, you want to see everything that the book of Genesis says. You So you, you're just going through Genesis, studying everything from Genesis 1 to the last verse of okay. Genesis. You see how it works. So either you are going... Um, chapter by chapter okay but when you read um, the book of Isaiah chapter 28 10 and 13 the Lord said but the word of the Lord was unto them precept upon precept precept upon precept um, line upon line here a little there a little yeah. so the Bible permits you to read here a little there a little learn from here no matter how you choose to read it it's still going to make sense it's going to come up with knowledge so if you want to know about a subject, that is fine. But if you don't want to, you could study here a little, there a little, and it's still going to help you in your Christian faith. A lot of people have not really read the whole Bible, uh -huh. but they have an in-depth knowledge in God because the word of, of the Lord unto us is here a little, there a little. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So you mentioned two different methods, right? Yeah. I know this person who, and this is how the person reads the Bible, right? Because the person believes God has a word for us every day, right? Mm -hmm. So you study the Bible every day, sure. but he doesn't particularly know where to start it. So what yeah. he does is he takes his Bible, then he drops it. Yeah. Where it opens is where he's studying. Mm -hmm. What about that method? So, like, let's say that one just opens the Bible and he says, the Egyptians you see today, you see them no more. Then he starts fighting Egyptians. <laughs> okay. That's just why they were but That is not always the best you know sometimes uh -huh. you you must have a structured way of studying the bible maybe topical or maybe verses because sometimes we have something called pretext mm -hmm. okay you take a verse from um, a point where you wouldn't see the clarity okay? okay so you have to start from the top to the bottom maybe if you are studying a verse mm -hmm. sometimes to get the contextual meaning you have to study from the, 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 the few verses before that verse mm -hmm. and then the few verses underneath yeah. that verse to get a clear contextual meaning okay. of that verse. Okay, that's very interesting. So you can use the topical method or the telescopic method yeah. in studying your Bible. Yeah. So as you're beginning the new year, as you're beginning the year 2024, let's get into the Word of God. Let's get into the Bible. And now we know the ways or the method to study. So we have no excuse. Yeah. I hope you'll be making it a point to study your Word. And don't be like my friend, or you're in your Bible, right? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was a really amazing time spent with you, Pastor oh, Julius. I, I love how you are intelligent you you're able to recall of course yeah. like a Sean Elizabeth what are you talking about <laughs> yeah, <young> lady. <laughs> yeah. okay guys it's been fun I hope you've learned something I hope you've had fun comment share subscribe tell us what you like to learn about tell us what you like to see your experiences and share this to someone let them learn something we'll see you again on the next episode stay blessed enjoy your time bye okay.